Welcome back, I'm Captain Xavier, and as everything is half off at Goodwill on Black Friday, my lovely partner, Seamstress at Arms and I, are hitting all ten Goodwills that are in the ten mile radius around my house to see what they've got for swag. So, stay tuned for the looting. Here is the haul. Goodwill number one. Goodwill number two. It turns out there's a value village on the route, so we're gonna go ahead and hit it just to see how sketchy it is in this part of town. A grand total of one recon. I'll take it. One value village. Alright, let's see what we've got. We, we... <clears throat> What'd you find there, honey? This is a raven. I don't have one of these because they're super hard to find. And it's going to cost me three dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go with that. Yes, yeah, what else we have? Uh, oh, goody! Goody, goody, gumdrop. Oh, this thing has led a rough life? <laughs> Somebody melted it? Okay, I intend to cut that part off anyway. We'll take that. And we're gonna take one of these. Because this is what one of my shoulder cannons is made out of. Oh, let's see. And we're going to take this grenade launcher. Sure, why not? I'll bet large sums of money that could take a few times. Goodwill number three out of ten. Too big for the floor, I'm sorry. Hey. Onward! Number four! Lovely. Lovely. Goodwill number five! Fabulous. Goodwill number six! Fabulous. Goodwill number seven! Fabulous! Fabulous! Goodwill number eight! Not a bloody thing. Tragic. On to the last one, which is probably closed, but we're gonna try anyway. The ninth and final Goodwill. We will not be going to the tenth Goodwill as it is a Goodwill outlet and is already closed and is sketchy. Not, not a whole lot on the last couple of ones, but we're gonna go home and we're gonna do the full inventory and see what all we ended up with. See you there. All right, we are now going to go through the hall and see what all we got because quite frankly, I have no idea. I know there's some Mavericks in there. Because <laughs> there are always Mavericks. Every, I am convinced that every goodwill on the planet at every given time has at least one Maverick. But we'll Wait. start at the top. We picked up one long shot with magazine but no priming handle, so. We'll see how that works out. One Rampage. Not Raider, Rampage. No magazine for it though, unfortunately. That's tragic. We picked up one Rebel bow of some kind with no string, but I'm after the air restrictor system. I'm gonna see if I can't do something interesting with that. My favorite non. We picked up a Black and Decker chainsaw. Hopefully, you know, for chainsaw bayonet type stuff, we'll see what I can do with that. It's very similar to the one on iron, but a little bit different. I think that one's a Home Depot, that's a Black & Decker, and the one you got... I have a craftsman. a craftsman. Yeah, I like the Craftsman one because the blade is actually removable. Nice. Oh, we picked up a pair of the Ultra Tech Star Air Warriors... Thingamabobs? Non-smart air restrictor pistols. 
I picked up a pair of Boomco pistols, one with its shield, one without. Maverick number one. Maverick number two. Make a pile of Mavericks. One strife. Very nice. No magazine, but it actually have its battery door. Two exploder. What the heck are these things? What do they even shoot? I have no idea. But I am after the barrels because they fit Boomco ammunition. So. They also have ridiculously big springs, and I can cut up the shells. Do you want me to do this that one will save. Later. We picked up one triad. That's fun. One off-brand flip fury flip fire. I don't know what the actual one is called. I think you actually have to manually rotate it though. But you know, cylinders are cylinders. We picked up half of a split strike. Don't have the other half of it, but this will at least allow me to test it for K26, so that's going on the list. A couple people asked about that one. One of whatever this is. A couple of those teeny One things. dart tag revolver. I'm sure this has a name. I'll have to look it up. It's going to be in a upcoming episode of Can I Take a K26. One strong arm. Nice to see those. All of my strong arms that I have came from Goodwill, so... For those of you who are interested in getting one of those upgraded, I have another one in stock. The Poor Man's Recon. That is having... That thing just has all kinds of issues. But this one came in its magazine. Quite frankly, I got it for the magazine because it's an eight-round magazine, which is an unusual number. One. Nitron. Uh, I've been wanting to do a Nitron pistol build, and somebody said I should do a Nitron shoulder mount build, and I think those would both be interesting, so went ahead and grabbed that. One Dart Zone Scorpion! Very nice. I saw someone who had uh, actually cut off the barrel and made it its own barrel attachment so they could add a revolving barrel to any gun, and then they had its own little battery pack. thought that was a neat idea, but... Uh, these are actually really nice. I've got one of them as a shoulder gun, of course. One Thunder Blast without grenades, but, you know, still a Thunder Blast. Very nice. One Red Night Finder. I did not know they had Red Night Finders, and now I have one. Missing its battery door, but I have lots of Night Finders. So if somebody decides they want the red one from my Etsy page, that is available, and I can just swap to battery doors. One Actual Recon! There were actually two of these. Yes. Two recons. Everybody knows the retaliator is better, but these are good for shell work. I cut up one of these when making my bullpup retaliator, so parts are parts. They've got their own barrel mounts and stock points, so those are both useful for some of the mods that I do. One barricade, also not a great blaster by itself, but I, you know, have the drain blaster barricade build, and I actually have a commission for one of those, so. I needed a Maverick number three! Woo. Maverick number four! This one's actually broken, which is why it was, you know, a buck. One Air Max Titan. Tyrant. Tyrant. No magazine. I was really bummed because I really want the magazine out of these. I picked up two of these at Goodwill, and neither of them had their magazine, which is just sad and tragic, but we'll make do. One Firefly with a slightly melted handle, which is fascinating and tragic because while I do cut the uh, grip off when I do the Drain Blaster build for this, uh, that part is actually partly used, so I may have to try to heat it up with a heat gun and reshape it, or come up with a slightly different design for the Drain Blaster build, but we'll see what I can do with that. One Surge 6 by Busby Toys. I figured, why on earth not? I don't think I have the gun that locks into it. But, there's that. One zombie strike crossbow looking thing with no prod. Another good one for Can It Take a K26 because these are loads of fun. We will find out. One deploy! 
Everybody's favorite blaster. Another popular request for can it take a K26 because people are hoping putting a K26 in it and taking out the air restrictor might actually make it useful. But you will have to wait until season three when I start doing magazine fed blasters. But that will be done eventually. One Buzzby Air Max Baron. Ah, I've been wanting to get my hands on one of these. Couldn't find them in stores uh, anymore. Uh, they may be out there somewhere, but I couldn't find them. So very happy to find one of these at Goodwill. Um, wanting to do the integration like in the Hellhound because that's just an awesome integration. Uh, so we will see what I do with that. Maverick number five. Woo. That is the last of the Mavericks, I believe. I have no idea what this thing is. It is some thing. It's got two barrels though, so I'm wondering how exactly it functions. Kind of looking forward to getting this open and seeing what's in there. One Rebel crossbow, which I actually have arrows for and no bows that fire said arrow. No, I do. I've got the one that's got the combination. No, that doesn't shoot the arrows. So yeah, no, I had nothing that shot the arrows. Now I have something that shoots the arrows. Why not? They're neat. I actually play a game where uh, you can't reuse your ammunition, but you can reuse arrows. So a little crossbow might actually be useful. What else do we have here? We've got one Fury Fire, which even if it won't take a K26, I do use the cylinders for absolvers, though I didn't much care for the 10-shot one, but good for parts. One little flywheel... Disc shooter, I got it for the discs because I want to do a, a, a barrel attachment for ire that shoots those. These were not at Goodwill, but they were at sale at Big Lots, and I needed more of the uh, Hot Shocks because uh, I imagine they're going to be popular. Uh, so I've got extra of those in stock, ready to go, should any of you want that particular upgrade. I also finally got a Snapfire because people were asking about that. So that will end up in an episode at some point. And finally, my big, my personal favorite find for the evening, the Raven. I did not actually have an original Raven in my collection. I have an, an Elite Raven, but uh, so many people love the uh, Straven build or use it for other integrations, so I'm really glad to have gotten my hands on one for next to nothing. An absolute steal. Actually, yeah, came with a magazine full of now probably horribly worn out and smashed darts, but there you have it. Um, yeah, all of this 50% off. Yay, Goodwill Black Friday sale. I had a blast. I'm going to have fun doing all sorts of terrible things with these. So stay tuned. Thank you for watching.